There's a reason why Hawaii's newspapers report on the number of visitors coming here. Hotels and tourism are Hawaii's number one industry. Hawaii's politicians think that when they take care of the hotel developers and mainland hotel owners, that they're taking care of Hawaii's people. But letting those developers and mainland hotel companies take more money out of Hawaii is the same as letting big fishing trawlers scoop up all the fish around the islands and then take them back to wherever those trawlers came from. Here is what the hotels in Waikiki look like. The black ones pay local people as much as $7 less an hour than the red ones. The black ones take the money they make out of Hawaii. They take the fish. The red hotels have union contracts, union wages, union benefits. More of the money the red hotels make stays in Hawaii. The red hotel workers spend the money they make in local stores. They pay local taxes. They fund local schools. More and more of the black hotels are limited service hotels or condos or timeshares. Limited service means limited jobs, limited wages, limited benefits, limited aloha. Visitors get less, workers get less, Hawaii gets less. And soon these hotels will be surrounded by more poverty. Neighborhoods suffer. Fewer local people with enough money to spend. When neighborhoods have fewer red hotel workers with money to spend, neighborhood businesses get hurt. When there are fewer red hotel workers paying taxes on good wages, the state has less money for neighborhood schools. When the fish get taken, locals can't fish. Food on the table is gone. Local community leaders want to take back Hawaii by building a movement to take control of our politics, to take control away from the developers and mainlanders who use the money they take from Hawaii to control Hawaii's politicians. Local community leaders care. Local five members care. They are building a movement. They call it, I care, because each of them says, I care about Hawaii. The red hotels have to compete with the black hotels. The red hotels are cutting jobs to cut costs to compete with the black ones. 1,600 local five jobs are gone already. The economists tell us that for each of those lost hotel jobs, another job disappears. Jobs in stores, jobs teaching kids, fewer fish. In each neighborhood, fewer people earning a decent living. 1,600 local five jobs gone equals 3,500 jobs gone, and the number is growing. Local community leaders understand that local five hotel workers can be the foundation for IKEA, but hotel workers are only the foundation. IKEA is a movement that needs more. It needs everyone. It needs foot soldiers to visit neighbors and Facebook friends. It needs a loudspeaker to spread the word. It needs voters to boot out the politicians who don't care. Join IKEA if you care. Take back Hawaii by taking back our economy. Keeping the fish here, keeping the jobs, and making them good jobs. Jobs that keep more money here. Better for our neighborhoods, better for our schools, better for our businesses, better for Hawaii. I care.